Ukraine assassinated the Russian general when he was sent by Putin to command the occupied area. Footage posted on social media shows the Russian-backed Andrei Shtipa's vehicle engulfed in flames in the Kherson region of southern Ukraine. The head of a Russian-installed Ukrainian village in the occupied territory was assassinated after concealed explosives blew up his car while he was sitting in it. Andrei Shtipa's car was filmed engulfed in flames several meters high, with black smoke billowing from the exploding vehicle, as Russian media reported the police chief had been killed. Another person in his car, believed to be his driver or a security guard, was also killed in the explosion. This is the second Russian-appointed leader to be killed in December after Berdyansk deputy leader Oleg Boyko and his wife Ludmila were both killed on Friday, September 16 in the Zaporizhia province in southeastern Ukraine. It is known that this is an assassination plan of the Ukrainian army to destroy the key leaders of Putin. Emergency services in Kherson Oblast told Russian news agency TASS that Shtipa died after explosives were planted in the vehicle. Dramatic footage of the incident shows the car engulfed in orange flames in the middle of Kakovka, near the village of Lubomovka. Shtipa was appointed village chief by Russia after Putin's forces occupied the territory in the early days of the conflict and later annexed the area in September. Despite his authoritative role, several Ukrainian residents could be seen cycling and driving past Shtipa's car as it was on fire, seemingly uninterested in saving the man. And his colleagues. Today, Ukrainian terrorists tried to attack the head of the village Lubomovka of the Kakovsky city district, killing him, regional emergency services said. Shtipa is presumed dead following the attack but his colleague's condition remained unclear for several hours. An update later confirmed the person remaining in the vehicle had died from their injuries. Another Putin general was killed by the Ukrainian army, Russia's war is facing more and more disadvantages.